ओके गूगल स्टार्ट मॉनिटर ओके गूगल प्ले बैक ओके गूगल टेक फोटो ओके गूगल स्टार्ट वीडियो ओके गूगल स्टॉप वीडियो असलम समीर सोगी विद यू Recently I have been diagnosed with compulsive raspberry pi syndrome or CRPS in short in this condition there is a compulsion to buy more and more raspberry pi and its accessories i have lots of raspberry pi and when this official display came out obviously i had to buy it with this i made dagboard dagboard is an awesome site with which you can display weather to do list calendar and there are many more things After that I got an HDMI in module from Avidia for testing as I have zero budget for the things I do I try to find DIY solution for things uh, as I shoot YouTube videos and I need an HDMI monitor uh, I use the HDMI in module coupled with the Raspberry Pi display to make it into an HDMI monitor the way this thing works is uh, I will place uh, the uh, display above the camera I'll connect the two with an HDMI cable and i will trigger a script present on the display uh, by double tapping it and what this will do is it will call raspberry wed uh, whatever the output of the camera is it will show on the display this way i can uh, see myself recently uh, the touch sensor of the display went bad and uh, what i have to do is i have to log in to the uh, raspberry pi via ssh and then trigger the script this has been a hassle as of now this uh, setup has two purpose dagboard uh, when it is on my desk and uh, hdmi monitor and then i got uh, an aiy voice kit for testing uh, since i didn't have any free raspberry pi i used the same raspberry pi of this setup and did the testing for aiy voice kit uh, then i realized that uh, why not use voice commands to trigger the start and stop script for the hdmi monitor so i modified the custom command code of uh, aiy voice kit so when i say uh, start display or stop display it would run the script and uh, uh, automatically the uh, setup will become an hdmi monitor this has made my life easier but still i have to reach for the camera to uh, press the start stop button as i have an esp8266 based ir remote for the sony camera i modified this setup to accommodate for that as well so i added ir led on the setup and i modified the code such that when i say the commands to let's say take photo start uh, recording stop recording uh, go into playback mode scroll through the photos Uh, it will send appropriate ir commands to the sensor on the camera and i don't even have to reach for the uh, camera anymore so uh, this is very useful for me now it is a dagboard one on my desk it is an hdmi monitor as well as it is a remote for shooting uh, videos keep on watching and i'll show how i went about it thank you so this is the raspberry pi display behind it is the raspberry pi on top of that there is the aiy voice hat on top of that there is the hdmi in module from avidia this is connected to the raspberry pi via a uh, flex cable going into the csi port the most important part of this project is this 3d printed stand from jensen uh he said it on thingiverse without which this project wouldn't have been possible this was supposed to be a photo booth 
and so it has a quarter 20 hole through which you can mount this thing uh, on a tripod and you see this part this part used to be over here and on top of that there used to be the raspberry pi camera i moved it from here to here and i placed the aiy microphone over here there is also an ir led which is used for the remote this is connected to uh, the aiy hat and uh, the signal is amplified with this transistor there was also the arcade button and speaker as part of this aiy kit but i removed it to reduce the weight of the setup now let's see uh, the software part of the setup as far as dagboard is concerned you can install it from the support site uh, i have linked it in the video description in order to overlay the camera on top of this so as to make this thing into uh, an hdmi monitor we have to call hdmi.sh this is a basic script which calls a raspberry bit for uh, 10 minutes uh, at uh, 720p 25 fps as the camera output is flipped on the screen i'm using horizontal flip i have already done a video on hdmi monitor i'll link it in the video description now let's see the custom aiy script the python script for this project what we will be defining here is uh, the voice commands we will say and the uh, corresponding function which will be called and via it the hdmi.sh script will be run so power off turn off reboot these are part of the script by default what i have added is if you say start monitor it will run hdmi script function let's see what hdmi script function is So this thing will run hdmi.sh command which will turn this setup into an hdmi monitor. What the second command does is it will display on the screen starting. Why we are doing this thing is because we have removed the LED. We have removed the speaker so, so there is no way to come to know what is going on. When this command is run png view will show starting on the display. And after 5 seconds it will go. Similarly, when you say stop monitor, it will call HDMI script stop, which will stop the raspberry bed. And similarly, it will use PNG view to display stopping on the screen for 5 seconds. As I forget what is the voice command I use generally like whether I call this thing a monitor or display. So I have used both monitor as well as start display and it will call the same script. This way I can use this thing to trigger the hdmi.sh script so as to make this thing into a monitor. In order to make this thing into a remote for the Sony camera, I have installed LIRC and I have connected an IR LED via a transistor to a GPIO 26. So you have to enable LIRC and uh, the output pin. I already know the IR codes for the Sony remote and the corresponding buttons. You can use the IR send feature of the LIRC software to send specific commands. We will be using that to trigger the Sony remote. We have defined all the buttons in the Sony uh, configuration. So this is the file. and uh, these are the buttons and these are the corresponding ir codes button trigger is uh, for taking photo button trigger video is for starting video and so on and so forth for navigation and everything so we have to trigger these buttons in order to control the sony camera and we will have to do this with voice commands so let's head back to the uh, python script So whatever voice commands we have to say, we have to add it first. So let's say we have take photo. So when you say take photo, this thing will be run the photo function. And what the photo function will do is uh, it will run 
आई आर सेंड सेंड वंस सोनी आर एम टी डी एस एल आर टू विच विच कंटेन्स द आई आर कोड फॉर बटन ट्रिगर ऑल्सो सिंस वी डोंट हैव एनी वे ऑफ फीडबैक वेदर इट प्रोसेस द कमांड और नॉट वी आर रिलाइंग ऑन पी एन जी व्यू एंड पी एन जी व्यू विल डिस्प्ले प्रोसेसिंग ऑन द डिस्प्ले फॉर फाइव सेकेंड्स सिमिलरली ऑल द बटन्स आर डिफाइंड हियर एंड द करस्पॉन्डिंग वॉइस कमांड्स आर डिफाइंड बिलो वट एवर द वॉइस कमांड्स यू वॉन्ट टू से यू टाइप इट हियर स्टार्ट वीडियो स्टॉप वीडियो स्टार्ट रिकॉर्डिंग स्टॉप रिकॉर्डिंग डिस्प्ले हिस्टोग्राम दीज आर द बटन्स विच आर पार्ट ऑफ द सोनी आई आर रिमोट नाउ अगेन लेट्स सी द एंटायर थिंग इन एक्शन लेट्स कनेक्ट द डिस्प्ले विद द कैमरा यूजिंग दिस कॉटो ट्वेंटी मेल स्क्रू this is the difficult part for me i need to find a better solution i'll power this thing on as you can see there is already on the screen this corresponds to the python script being run and ready to listen as well as dashboard comes on by default the ir led is uh, pretty close to the ir sensor connect the camera with the hdmi in module so this is a custom hdmi uh, cable which is super light and strong remove the lens cap and test it out okay goga start monitor so this way it has become an hdmi monitor you can see the videos present in the camera okay goga go left okay google play back this way you can navigate and now it is showing the current setup my uh, face is being shown and this way it is acting like in uh, hdmi monitor I hope you can see it. Okay Google, start recording. As you can see it has triggered the video recording. Okay Google, stop recording. As you can see uh, it has stopped recording. Okay Google stop monitor So it has uh, stopped the monitor and it is back to da being dashboard uh, Okay Google turn off So it has shut down the Raspberry Pi display uh, Hope this has been uh, informative for you Thanks for watching and do subscribe